Okay, so after a ton of uh, troubleshooting and finding out that I had a dud duet board, um, I finally am getting it to print. And it's printing the first test G code that's pre sliced. It is quiet. I was kind of skeptical when they said it was quiet, but and it's fast. Look how fast this thing is. It's just flying, it's just like whoop. Okay, yeah, this is, now I see why people are excited about this printer. I mean, I am, because I bought it, but. Uh, this is the filamentum uh, stuff that came with my Prusa. Also, just for scale, like, I have to step back. Step back some more. Like, a lot. Yeah. This is a huge printer. Like, it has a, theoretic like, basically half a meter of height and 300 millimeters of printing diameter. Hey Mitch, what are we printing right now? We are printing a, it looks like a Benchy because I've printed like a bajillion of them. Um, so what's cool about this is actually I can test, I can get my uh, Prusa Benchy and compare it with this Benchy. Benchy? Benchy. The little boat Yeah, the demo? boat, yeah, boat demo. But anyway, yeah. So luckily I had a spare duet board. Um, so we were actually able to swap the duet board and they're going to send me a new one um, to swap out with it, but um, yeah, everything's fast about it. it. It heated up really quickly. It started printing really quickly. Auto calibration works first time. I don't even have the bed. I don't have the tension clips. Um, but uh, yeah, I'm just super fascinated. Um, the whip is kind of interesting just because of how it's mounted in the middle. Um, and yeah, Artemis. Okay, don't mind the squeaking in the background.